Righto, welcome back to another episode. It's been a minute. Now this is a bit of a follow on from when we sold the truck. A lot of people asking what's next, what's next, what's next. And we've given you a few little snippets of what's next. We obviously sold the truck and we're back in Perth now, back home. And this was originally part of the plan. We didn't plan on coming home this quick. But because of this, we decided to come home, get rid of the truck, get rid of everything, kind of have a bit of a reset, didn't we? Yeah. Bit of a reset. Um, we didn't know how we were gonna have a baby on the road, all that kind of stuff. So it was like, what do we do? And then we just thought, let's just go home and swap our setup. So swap setup. So we've sold the truck, we've sold the trailer, we've sold the buggy. You're asking where's the boat? The boat's still in Queensland with the guy that's building the tray for the new truck. Obviously behind us, you can see the chimney. So we picked up the chimney. Uh, and that was all part of the plan. If you remember back at Christmas time, we bought the chimney. Uh, and we just decided to basically, and now you've seen we're selling the house. That was just a... Uh, spur of the moment. Spur of the moment. We think it's the right time. Um, yeah, it was just one of those things going, it's too good for a rental house. And we think it just went downhill to the point where we went, we don't wanna live in that anymore. Let's cash out, take the money, and we'll invest it into something else. Maybe. Block of land we're looking at, lots of things going on. Now, we are planning on traveling again. So as soon as, so we've also got a van on order. Uh, so the truck will be here next year. Early to mid next year, the truck will be here. Uh, and it's basically big, a full turnkey package from Queensland. So drive it over, I'll, I'll drive over with the Jimmy, pick it up and bring it home. And it's basically turnkey and I don't have to do anything. And I wasn't messing around this time with doing anything. I didn't want to mess around and do all that kind of stuff, so I just got it done this time. Uh, and then we'll come back home, or I'll come back home because Beck will be home with that thing. Yeah. And we've got to wait for the van to come. And that should be here late next year. This time next year, I reckon. Uh, hopefully, hopefully all going well. And then we're gonna wait around for Christmas. We'll probably do a couple little trips in the van and probably wait for that one's first birthday and then we'll shoot off again. And then it's indefinitely. Like we don't plan on coming home. We'll come home for whatever, holidays, whatever. Um, depends where we are, we'll fly, drive, something, but we'll just live and work on the road. Hence why we've gone to a van. Uh, there was nothing wrong with the old truck or anything like that. It was just, we just outgrew it, I guess, you know? Two years, or we had that for what? We had the truck for four years. Four years we had that for, so. And the camper, the camper two years, so. You know, we got our money's worth out of it. We, we learned a lot from it. And then we just decided to upgrade. Just, yeah, we wanted a chimney. The buggy was great, but we went, oh, we wanted to go to town, we had to take the truck, and it just got a little bit annoying. So that's why we sold the buggy and had, and had the Jimny idea. Uh, if I work, Beck's got a car, all that kind of stuff. That's, that's what it was about. We've seen lots of families on the road that she basically just had to sit around all day. He took the car to work, obviously, and so it got hard. But yeah, that's a bit of an insight to what's going. We're still going to travel. We're still going to do little trips in the chimney. You know, we're just down the beach. Yeah. That's about all that's what's next. Nothing nothing major or, you know, so exciting. It was just a, it was just the next process. That put a spanner in the works. Uh, we weren't really meant to be home until Christmas. February. Yeah, we weren't, but we decided to come home and and uh, kind of deal with this and 
that's why we're now, that's why we're here. But we've got a jimmy going, so we can still kind of go away and do some things, but yeah, we're just really just hanging out until the, until the new truck and van come, aren't we? Have a baby, relax, go back to work, make some money, all that kind of stuff, so yeah, that's a bit of an insight into what's going on, really. Um, hope that answers a lot of the questions that you know there's always people messaging going what's you know what's next blah, 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 blah. so that's what's next nothing nothing too over the moon um, there'll be lots more videos coming of the truck build and all that kind of stuff it'll be a few quite a few months of just this hanging out down the beach uh, yeah that's about it isn't it yep. I guess we'll see you on the next one when the truck comes and we'll still make dumb videos <laughs> still make dumb videos I like dumb videos I'll do a little Jiminy build series uh, and that'll be there'll probably be two or three parts of that and I'll probably do lift tires walk around uh, but you'll see that coming in the next few months anyway we're gonna cook some lunch have a feed hopefully Riley wakes up soon He's, uh, he loves the car, loves, just can't handle it. Look. Just absolutely zonks it. And just can't handle it. But yeah, we'll just uh, have some lunch. Enjoy the view. Show him the belly bump. No, she won't do that. Anyway, we'll catch you on the next one.